Oh, what's happening on the right side? Oh, you idiot. <laughs> no. Oh, it just has a T28. Oh, and it just totally ruined it all. Oh my god, it totally ruined the ammo truck and the pack and everything. What a troll. That's such a meme. It just drove the wrong way. We got artillery coming in though. Okay, what did that objective, what did that even say? I, I can't, not even Oh, well, we just blew it up. Oh my god. Oh, we have lost all of these people for some reason. Oh, it's the, the little thing that could. Oh, oh crap. All right, well, you know. All right, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to more Gates of Hell. And God, I was thinking about this game all freaking night. And not in a weird way. I just mean, like, I got into the game. I didn't have a lot of time yesterday. But I wanted to get back into Gates of Hell so freaking bad. I just got up early this morning, made a coffee, and here we freaking are. So if you haven't seen the last episode, which I severely doubt, but if you haven't seen it, I will link it in the description. What we did, if you haven't seen it, very quick sort of recap is we did stuff and we're here. No, I'm kidding. We started down here and we basically pushed our way over to this broken bridge, cleared the area over here, and then we pushed more towards the north, cleared these trenches, got ourselves a nice level warfer, and now our job is to push across, clear out this position on the hill, which looks to be really pretty fortified, and then to drive the enemy out of Glushkovo itself. We do have, uh, luckily, some reinforcement points available. Uh, we also found out at the very end of the last episode, as you can see here, this is sort of entrenched on this far side of the, uh, the river, that we are going to have to use some pretty heavy firepower, I think, to get through. Also, including this 37mm anti-aircraft gun that is on the opposite side of the river now we can get packs i actually couldn't get those earlier but we can get them now um we also can get student pioneer so i'm thinking we'll buy some of these uh, we i don't think we can get any cool armor that we couldn't get earlier we can get the same ones oh actually well, we can get a panzer 4d now look at that we'll get a panzer 4d and i guess we should get a scout and sniper and a ketten cloud and then I think uh, we're gonna take a look here as they come into the battle for this must be... Ooh, they come in a half track? Okay, that's cool. The Student Pioneer's come in a half track. Here's the Panzer IV D with the short barrel infantry gun 75 millimeter, which just looks freaking awesome. Look at this thing. Look at the detail on the crew hatches. Like, what the hell? Oh my God. It's just like, it's freakingly insane how good that looks especially these crew the detail on the crew hatches alone is making me freak out oh my god and then we have i said like we have the half track over here which comes with our student pioneers is there anything in the half track it looks like there's an extra machine gun in there maybe unless that's maybe the rear machine gun oh there's a rear machine gun on here it looks like so let's move those guys over to here and then we'll have them disembark and then our ken cod here with the sniper scout team uh, so we'll definitely get to use them in a second because they're going to have to go up here and, well, do the scouting. So that's what we got them for. So we'll move those guys up as well. And then I guess we could potentially push from the um, side over here. But I'm thinking it makes more sense to push from this area because we know that there's this 37 mil here in the trenches. So we'll start working our way over here. So yesterday, uh, in pure assault squad fashion... I only added two crew to this light infantry shoots. Turns out, I should have read the tooltip, it can actually hold four crew and it will actually be more effective once it obviously has more crew on board. But I don't want to do that right now. I'm kind of low on manpower and I do really need this mortar to be manned alongside with this light infantry shoot. So it's not going to be performing at the top of its abilities. That's just going to have to be the way it works for right now because we do need to move our mortar up. And I don't have a lot of infantry. I mean, I could buy some more. We're going to relatively low on manpower already. Let's take a look at our uh, student pioneers here. Oh, they do look really awesome. Maybe we'll get everyone out besides there's one. Okay, so maybe we'll get everyone out of here. And then what we could do is we can call in another Panzerwaffe. Uh, we can assign some of those to the Light Infantry Schutz. 
and we can assign uh, one to be the machine gunner on this half track. Let's take a look at this squad here because they do look freaking awesome. These guys are a little bit more, uh, it looks like they're a little bit more automatic. We have MP41s, I believe, which is a um, sort of mix between a PPSH and a MP40, where I believe it's a PPSH, but it can take MP40 mags. Uh, we have PPSH with the drum mags. Is it a flamethrower I see? Oh my god, that's nuts. Okay, uh, K98 with just okay, Kabalta Ladunga, lots of uh, heavy weapons, MP40s. We have a medic part of this squad. Okay, so we have a little bit of a pushing squad here. No machine gun, but I guess the machine gun we can call in from the, uh, the half track. So let's get this other unit on board of... Where did they go? Here they are. I do love that in this game, reinforcements come in on vehicles. It just makes such a big difference. All right, with a little bit of finicking, I managed to get uh, three tank crew inside of this half-track. So we're mounting the front and rear machine guns as well as the actual driver position. And now we have a four-man crew light infantry shoots. Yes, I'm aware that tank crew probably wouldn't man light infantry shoots. They would have a specific artillery crews for that. But because... Uh, Tank crew costs 40, and an entire squad costs 150, and I don't even want to spend a lot of points right now. I've decided to do it this way. Now, we do have our little two-man recon section here, so we're going to try and crawl forward and spot what's on the other side of the river, because I don't want to just push in and get absolutely obliterated. Once our, our uh, spotters have eyes on something, however, I would be totally down to call in Nettlewerfer and Mortar Support. On it. Did it just start raining? Or more heavily than it already was? It feels like it started doing that. We can take over our sniper here. Oh, I like this. Uh, is that Panzerlied? That's awesome. You hear that? That's a, that's a version of the Panzerlied that I just heard playing in the background. That's really cool, actually. We're just trying to get eyes on this position. Okay, we have a bunch of targets. It would be nice if we could spot there. Okay, that's so cool. I'm just sitting here with a huge smile on my face. Like I didn't expect them to have a version of the Panzer lead in this. That's really cool. It's like kind of a Hoi 4. I think Hoi 4 has a Panzer lead version as well in their game. Okay. We just spotted the 37 mil, which looks to be unmanned. Oh, maybe our Nebelwerfer. Look, our Nebelwerfer might have knocked off the crew. That's perfect. So I think we could potentially start mortaring. Is it? it? Oh, here's a shell ready. That's really cool. Okay, let's see. We can start mortaring the positions here. I don't know where they just went. There. You're not going to engage? I'll engage with F6 then, I think. All right, we're going to start pushing in. Our Panzer IV short barrel is engaging hostiles on the riverbank. We're just trying to get as many of our units here on the field as possible. I'm trying to get my mortar to engage. There we go. Mortar's engaging. Take a look and see if we can, in the meantime, spot some specific targets. It would be nice to take out... Oh, what's that? Okay, just a machine gun. So maybe our light infantry shoots could take out this Maxim right there. Ooh, got some of the crew knocked off of it. Looked like we just have one left. Fire again. Ooh, there we go. Crew is out. Now what else is there? I see another... Okay, another stationary machine gun it looks like. I'm looking for it. I might be on the I might be looking too close to my side here. Is that it right there? I think so. Can you see that? I'm trying to get Oh, that was pretty that was pretty accurate. It's kinda hard to see, but you can see the machine gun just barely up in there. Maybe if I just give it a target position marker, there we go. And uh, we could probably roll some of our infantry forward now. Our sniper, if we can just maybe snipe the crew off of that machine gun. I don't know how effective that might be. See, I'm having some trouble acquiring... Oh, there he is. I think it's right there. Okay. Let's aim. 
And perfect. Oh, that's bad. Oh, what a marksman. Didn't have a great amount of uh, visibility there. Okay, so maybe we can roll up our scout SMG gunner. Like a charging sort of thing. Our sniper is trying to engage infantry on the ridge. Okay. Well, I like how the weather just totally changed. It became a lot brighter all of a sudden. Let's move up our scout cars. I guess this isn't even a scout car, but let's move up our... Are you, are you stuck? Oh, you're good. Come on, let's go. Infantry is pushing across. Someone said this thing has a smoke screen launcher, though. Oh, it does. Okay, let's pop it. Sort of cover the advance as we push up to the far side here. Throw some more smoke grenades. And another one. There we go. Look at that. Oh, that's really cool. Okay, okay. I see, I see. Oh, the terrain is so messy for this guy. Is this the bridge right here? Oh. I think this is the bridge right here in front of us. Okay. Go right. And set. This thing's just a little wacky. Maybe go back. Oh, I didn't mean... Uh, I was pressing S this entire time. That's really annoying. All right, Metal Warfare. Oh, that sounds so cool. Oh, look, we took out both of them there. I don't know how towable this thing is. Well, it might be towable, but I think it's pretty much... Oh, of course, we have ammo. I can just push it in the ammo truck area. Nice. I'm smart. See, I I do things. We'd even tow some of these guns if we were going across very fast. But, yeah, so we didn't lose that uh, armored car. It's kind of whatever. I mean, it happens, I suppose. Let's get our... Where is this? There's one enemy left in here. He's got a machine gun, though. Okay, let's run up our sniper assistant. Charging, 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 charging. Oh! <laughs> I think I think the back blast from the Panzer IV. Knocked him on his feet. Wow. That's nuts. Can we get anything from here? Oh my god. I think that's what happened. I think the, the back blast hit him. Uh, let's uh, grab a PPSH is superior, right? I mean, this is what they do. They pick up enemy equipment. Might as well do it. Uh, binoculars aren't necessarily really needed. Uh, and drop the pistol and the ammo for that pistol. And then um, take up our PPSH. We might as well just do something epic here and try to push this. Oh, there's a guy on the... What is this guy doing right here? He's down. Oh, that was awesome. The ragdoll on that guy when he got hit was like... Alright, we knocked out the anti-aircraft facilities here. Secure. Secured. Oh, this guy's a hero. Oh, crap. We're still taking some light. Oh, crap. I think I see him. When we go prone. Yay. Oh, that takes a very long time to throw the grenade. Okay, that was... I didn't... I haven't thrown a grenade yet in direct control, so I almost blew myself up there. I think we could do... We could sneak in, grab this guy's grenade. So this game, by the way, when you think about it, it's totally nuts. Just now, I was controlling this huge, relatively army size. I mean, it's not a huge army. It's an army army size, but a huge amount of units. And two seconds later, oh, I lost one member of this uh, medic, 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 medic. And like five seconds later, I'm, I'm controlling a single dude. And then a second later, I'm telling all of these other units to go across the river, and it's just so cool. Let's try and grab some of this guy's equipment here. 
I really, that's why I really like this over the Assault Squad 2 camera. You're just so much more in the action. It's so awesome. So unique. There isn't not many games like this out there, honestly. Okay, let's try and go around. Secure this with a PPSH in hand. Is this, uh, is this area clear, boys? It looks like it. We could probably knock one of these or grab one of these 37s. I mean, I, this is a really funny thing. I like this little light tank. This might be a little... Ooh, that would be a good weapon to give to maybe someone who's a little bit more uh, on the machine gun side of things. But I guess we got this crew up here, which is important. We can man this machine gun. And we can get across the river. Can we use this? Okay, machine guns are still a two-man thing. I was, I was very surprised to see that I'm assuming anti-tank guns and artillery are now four-man crew units, not just two. Okay, let's push in here. Our marksman push across the river. So I just realized that I can actually give ammo, which, by the way, this ammo truck looks fucking awesome. I just gave 60 rounds of ammo to my Nettlewerfer, so we have a huge amount of rocket artillery ready, basically, for any future endeavors. Uh, we're just going to maybe keep... Uh, maybe we should just push up everything. It doesn't really matter. Even my half-track over here. We do have 460 manpower. We can... Oh, we have to get you... I think we have to get you out of this situation, don't we? you uh, around the little oh look at that this game looks so cool I can't I can't stop talking about it I'm just freaking out about it all the time now okay let's get the half track over here and let's start getting the mortar up and maybe we'll get the mortar to be resupplied I actually didn't really fire that many shells anyway all right that was not bad however obviously we should get our marksman and our maybe we should even put some infantry on one of these 37s and use it as just a basic i mean does he have anything that i need to give to the machine gunner yes we have a 250 round there we go okay maybe we'll have all of these uh we'll figure out two crew that i can use this guy and I guess this is machine gun assistant. And the rest of this, you can go to the ammo truck, resupply, and then these two can man a 37 mil. See, I wonder if they're a four man crew or if they're more than a four man crew. We're gonna find out right now. Or, sorry, a two man crew or a four man crew that is necessary for that. Let's make sure these guys are all getting their ammo. And then, can we put. Okay, you can put more than two people, or... Okay, okay. So is it four? Probably is. Oh, it says three, I think. Okay, so we have to find one more person that we could kind of maybe... Maybe one from over here, all the way over here. These guys are just kind of standing yeah. around uh, doing super big, crazy things. Actually, thinking about it, I should probably have manned one of these guns, right? At least turned them around and... Spread these guys out a little bit more. I'm not even expecting a huge attack here, but at this point I might as well be a little bit less messy. Uh, let's get you all the way over here. And rotate this. I guess maybe repair it as well. Oh, can you not repair this thing? Is there anything in his box? No. Okay, maybe we cannot repair it. It looks like it's not super broken though. But we'll just turn it around for now and maybe use it later. This guy gets on the 37. Can we move this? Oh, we can. Okay, so we have a portable 37 mil now as well. Great. All right, let's with the put the marksman and the uh, scout together, and we'll push forward. So we still have to just get the high ground here, and then um, disembark these guys. Okay, and our Nettlewerfer can finally get going. Does the Nettlewerfer even need more than two crew then? The can have four crew. Huh. Maybe we'll take the crew off this machine gun just for the time being and put them on the Nettlewerfer. Because, I mean, look, it'll look cooler and we also already have a machine gun half track. I have enough infantry. I have like, what, three different tanks, a Panzer three, a Panzer four, and a Panzer 38. So don't really need that extra machine gun ability, I don't think. What we could do, though, is just use the sniper, or the scout team to scout ahead and see what's going on. 
Oh crap. We just started getting under fire from the position on the hill. But I mean, really, we know that it's there. Why don't we just go fast forward? Put up our Nebelwerfer. Reload these two guns. And then we could just start lobbing stuff at this hilt. I mean, this looks like a position that they would occupy. It doesn't get old. It really doesn't. It looks so cool. It sounds so awesome. Oh, they destroyed something. They got veterancy. Uh, so I guess if they cut one vehicle and 20... The vehicle might count because it's a, like an artillery piece, I suppose. Can I put more people on this? No, okay. It was that three-man thing. So what is the thing here? Oh, that's so cool. Do you actually have a guy in the very back, like, towing the little... Uh, like, pushing the tow thing? That's so cool. Okay. So, I don't know if we could get any I'm eyes on here. something on this position, though. Doesn't look like we can really see much. Let's try and run forward. Oh, sniper! There's there something that big that just fired at us. You can hear that. Oh, that's a mortar. Okay, another worker. This is going to be constantly firing. Maybe we'll hold fire for... Ooh, that was a good direct hit on whatever that position would it be. There's another position over here. Maybe a, even a tank in this barn, considering there is or there was one over here. So why don't we figure that out as we kind of, let's see, push everything up a little bit. Reload some of these things. I just like having all my stuff reloaded for when I need it. I'm not really sure how deep this defensive line is going to go. I can't really see anything. That's the main issue. But maybe our scout, if it just stays low, we can maybe get eyes on and get accurate marks for my mortar and the other... Where's my mortar, actually, anyway? Oh, it's over here. Okay, perfect. Mortar, push up. Let's see if we can get any eyes on... Oh, we got one. That's a guy right there. We could potentially snipe him, but that just doesn't really do anything for me. Okay, well, our pens are four. What, what was that firing? Oh, okay. All right, like, whoa, it's really it's that quick? It's probably because it's a four crude. Oh, no, okay. So they were two things firing. It's the pens are four and the... Um, like, the infantry shoots were both firing. But maybe we can just put you in here and maybe even hold fire. Who knows? It would be nice to get a rocket barrage right on that position. Oh, that, <laughs> that tree might be an issue. Uh, let's not shoot through the tree again. Look, in in let's be real here. In Men of War Assault Squad, that tree would have exploded and you would have killed the launcher and I would have been really upset. So I'm happy that didn't happen. Uh, but I guess I learned the hard way that you can't really mess around with the trees now. It's all right. Oh, okay, we knocked out. Well, look at that. We found a, uh, one of their guns over here. Our 37 mils now engaging, which is good. I want my mortar to maybe start engaging some of these positions. Is there, like, a sniper in the... Oh, we might have actually destroyed them windmill. Okay, fair enough. I'm just trying to get eyes on before I really push in. I really want to use my... Flamethrower boys. I freaking, they're over here, right? Oh, there's a thing. What is there? Oh, it's a 37 mil. Or it's uh, not a 37 mil, but it's a job for a 37 mil, though. Although I can't really see it anymore now. I don't know if he could... I don't know if he could take that BT... I think that might have been a T26. Hopefully it knocks it out. Nope, not a knockout blow. Looked cool though. 37 mil, let's go. Work your work your butt off on this thing. Oh, what's that behind it? Mortar? Uh, my mortar. Cannot engage that too far away. Mortar must, needs to push up. Infantry shoot needs to push up. Oh crap, that was a good hit. You can see some of the guys just went flying there. Oh, crap. I 
Uh, where's my medic? Gonna run him back in there like a hero that he is. We need to get my Nebelwerfer on this position. Oh, those rockets are so cool. I'm hoping we get a good hit on this. Perfect hit. Perfect hit. I don't know if we have any other... Okay, this might, might be down, down. It might be actually killed, which is really annoying. Because this unit's now a little less effective, but whatever. Let's get our flamethrower boys in here. And, oh crap, we're losing crew on this left side here. We're losing it due to this freaking... Engage the damn thing. Is it over here? That's a horrible shot. Oh, crap. Okay, this Panzer... F this uh, T-26 is being a really... Okay, we finally got it, I think. We did have we have some issues with our tanks down here. We didn't lose oh well, we lost the crew in this mortar position. That's fine, we can go up here. Double warfer, engage. Perfect. Where's my flamethrower? We'll use the flamethrower here in a second. I just want to make sure this um, area over here is covered by my medic. Uh, we lost one of the three. We lost one of the two crew members on this mortar, but we just put one of our riflemen on here. And then put the other guy on there again. And then now, I guess, we could uh, try and push up with everyone. They don't have a machine gun. I need to get that machine gun half over here. Where did it go? We need that fire support, base of fire, before we can really push up here. Our lieutenant's still alive, which is good. Our half truck is pushing up. The music in this game is really awesome, by the way. I gotta say that. Uh, these guys are still good. They're good. Is that one? Did they have like a whole team? Or is that, is that just this one squad that got annihilated? Uh, it might be that squad. Oh well. You know. Let's push up, boys. Reload. Half track is here, isn't it? Oh, it's very, it's like very bogged down over here. For the east, okay, they're sending in some light armored reserves. That's whatever. We'll deal with that. This is really cool. This feels like a. Uh, Command, this feels like uh, World at War almost. I don't know why I said Command and Conquer. Oh, God damn it. There was a guy flanking me. That's what happened there. Where did my half track come? Okay, here it is. Do I have any. Nope. Oh, I could get a pack gun. I should actually get a pack gun ASAP because that's probably the best thing I can get to deal with their armor. If it's any heavier than what I've been dealing with, I'm going to have an issue. Don't run in front of the gun or half track, sorry. Medic, go, go, go. Oh, here they are, here they are, here they are. Did you see that? Oh, they're coming, they're coming, they're coming. Oh, it's not towed. Oh, that's bad. They're BT sevens? Crap. Hi. No, I'm trying to get in the trench. Oh, god damn it. Everything's gonna go bad here. This is gonna go very bad. Go, 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 go. I'm sending this ammo truck back. The ammo truck is going back to try and pick up the pack. 
but I don't know if it's gonna be good or not. Might not be effective enough. I'm really trying to get into this building. I do have some... I have a Cabalta lab and we could probably just knock out this entire building. Oh, that's a really cool effect in the background there. I need this medic. Where'd my medic go? I wonder if we can get him inside this building here. No, get in! Oh my god. Okay, we gotta get our medic or our... Oh crap, there's a guy laying in that... Oh, there's a guy laying behind the BT. Stop driving! <laughs> we lost a... Oh my god. This is insane. I gotta say, that was... Like, it's, it's fun to me when... A game like this makes a, a light tank like the BT-7 look scary, which it is at this point, like the way I was positioned there. By God, this truck isn't going very fast, though. Pick it up already. God damn it. All right. There's a lot of people behind that, I think. Start getting them up. Oh, Lieutenant cannot die. I mean, he could, but I don't want him to die. It's a different story, I guess. Let's get our half track repositioned. Flamethrower, get in the trench, start healing up. Get our medic up. This 37 mil has been very invaluable, I'm pretty sure. Uh, where's my number warfare? Look at that, a pack has arrived. It's taken an hour. We've almost captured this hill, which hopefully gives me some sort of like reinforcements. Um, okay, we're gonna swap out the medics. He's gonna go back, stay with the lieutenant over here. There we go. This is the pioneer, yeah, this is the pioneer unit. So you just have the flamethrowers in them still. Did he just switch positions? Did I just see that happen? I don't know, maybe not. I was not really paying attention there, but I saw something move like crazy. So, I guess we didn't lose some of these guys. Uh, send our recon units in here. Mostly our PPSH hero, who's going to knock out some of the infantry in this trench here, probably. Let's see if we can find a grenade right there. There's definitely a delay, which is good. There's a there's a short delay there that I have to get used to in this game. Oh, what's happening on the right side? Oh, you idiot. <laughs> no. Oh, it just as a T28. Oh, and it just totally ruined it all. Oh my god, it totally ruined the ammo truck and the pack and everything. What a troll. That's such a meme. It just drove the wrong way. We got artillery coming in, though. Okay, what did that objective... What did I even say? I, I can't... Not even Oh, well, we just blew it up! Oh my god. Okay, so... I was... Uh, I was so busy trying to read what that said. I knocked out a T-28 with a rocket strike. That's awesome. It was all accidentally, but now we're sort of stuck over here, I feel like. Uh, let's get two of these. We'll run them across the river, and we'll back that up with... Uh, what have we not got yet? Like a Panzer II would be kind of cool, I guess. Panzer II F? The 20 mil on you? Oh, we've lost all of these people for some reason. Oh, it's the, the little thing that could... Oh, oh, crap. All right, well, you know. We'll get this uh, unit, or these units, to push across to the river over here. Okay, got this uh, area over here. This looks so cool, just this road and 
Oh, it's just, I can't stop freaking out about how cool this is. All right. Pretty decent large push. We still have some points left, too. Wait, they all dismounted again? Oh, probably because they took some light fire, isn't it? God damn it. Let's make sure this is clear over here. I mean, I can't really imagine there's much to go on, but... Let's make sure this area is clear, and then we'll send our recon team over to sort of scout, start scouting out the area. And our Nebel Werfer... Oh, we're still really good. We don't have to really worry about ammo or anything. Okay. Panzer II and a half track push up while the truck dismounts its infantry. I mean, the, the truck with the Pac-40 came across relatively fine, although that was more to the left. So I don't know if this area here is safe or not. It actually looks like there could be something. Does this look really cool? Let's get our infantry to march across and see what that looks like. Our medic stays with this single guy back here. Is this enough people? Okay, good. We have something over here. Oh, okay. It's just uh, nothing way to worry about. We could actually send our flamethrower up maybe, or we could try and rock at this area. That'd be out of range, okay. Where did my scout team go? There's like some light guys, it's like sort of round randomly in the trees. Two tanks, T4, it's the amphibious T40. So one of weed is long. Oh, over here. AT gun. Position. Keep moving up, keep moving up, keep moving up. Neville Warfer should engage any second. Right? They're not engaging it. Do something about it. We're gonna lose these two. Pull them back, pull them back, pull them back, pull them back, pull them back. Another 37 over here. We'll just have to engage that 37 if we can instead. Okay, that's good. Oh, we knocked the crew off of it. Perfect. Dude, this Nebel Warfare is actually making this mission not too hard. I can imagine without the Nebel Warfare, this mission would have been a complete mess. Just having to deal with these entrenched units. Tons of machine and fire going on there. It's going to clear this back line. I'm literally have no reason not to. I mean, last time we did, we found a Nebel Warfare. Now, I'm not saying we're going to find another Neville Warfare here, but you don't know. We didn't knock out that position. We'll have to knock out this position next. Cr keep crawling my infantry forward. And this lieutenant team. And this little infantry section. Oh, that's a good hit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, that was a very far round that landed just out of no in uh, nowhere. I know if he can stay prone or not where he is. I hope he can. Be nice to engage some of these guys in the trench back here. Oh, he's actually engaging my vehicle from back there. It's kind of annoying. Okay. We'll have to deal with this like an adult. And by that I mean we lob uh, rockets at it. We are in range and we're ready to fire. Perfect. Okay, slowly crawling up. Okay, okay. Keep pushing up. Got a flanking position. 
Okay, almost. Ich brauche einen Sanitäter! I'm hoping that maybe... Oh, it doesn't really go that far. Oh, that looks really cool, though. I think this thing might finally be on fire. Sir? Everything's going on fire, but not the tank. God damn it, run away! We didn't have much ammo left. Try not to waste it all. God damn it. Alright, what's my Nebo Warfare doing? Hey, Nebo Warfare, you want to hit this? I'm going to run this guy away right now. Run, 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 run. Oh, crap. That was very danger close. Oh, it's still danger close, actually. We hit something back there. Okay, screw it. We'll do the flamethrower one more time. Let's not. Let's why not try. I think we got it. I think it's on fire. Engine is. Mosin, Mosin. Hey, look at that. Oh, the crew's on fire. Let him burn, let him burn. Oh, he's not on fire. He's dead now. Nice. Okay, that was cool. The Luftwaffe cannot help me. Oh, no. Okay. Ammo, 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 ammo. Where did my... Okay, I need a pack. And a truck. And then the, the truck can tow the pack. For one second, I thought that the green arrows, my reinforcements coming from the rear, were enemy uh, tanks that they reported just now, and I was about to freak the hell out. My 37 though can probably just like, cover the road. Oh, there is this 37 mil still. The T28, T28. Oh crap, those guys are very accurate. We knocked the tracks off of one of these, the, the, the T28. Uh, go grab the gun, stop. Dude, they get the hell over here with this thing. Suck so, okay, these guys were very accurate at knocking me out there. Medic is ready to heal. And then we flank around this building. Oh crap! Can't really flank around right now. Oh, that guy. Medic, medic, you're not gonna survive. Get off his body. Oh my god. Get this thing over here ASAP. Let's roll. Need a repair, I think. Charge disposition. You guys stay together. Good them pioneers. Get the hell in here. Go, 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 go. Oh, that sucks. We just took a rifle grenade or something. Oh, we're not in the trench. God damn it. This isn't even a real trench. I thought it was a trench. It's really not. It's really not a trench. We need this medic up here ASAP. Oh my god, we're getting destroyed up here. Let's keep pushing up over here. Tank. Nebel Werfer, best anti-tank weapon, as we have found out. It's having, maybe it's the angle on it is not good enough because it's not firing. We got our Panzers to push up here, ASAP. Oh crap. Get up. Pioneer medic. One, two, three, four. Oh, the entire squad is down. This is really awkward. Push the trench over here. Let's 
Smoke grenade. Smoke grenade. More smoke grenades. Knock that one out. I'm trying to get smoke to cover this position. Medic is working on everyone else. Let's see if we can see what's all the way back here. Maybe there's nothing. Who knows? But get across the river, you idiot. Okay, we've lost some of our men here, including that sniper team. That's really annoying because they were doing so good. Medic's working, picking people up ASAP still. Oh, we're stuck on the tree, god damn it. Oh, that sucks. Come on, get out of there, brother. I don't want a micro right now. I don't have the, I need the time to do so. Oh, we're getting sniped or something. What's that? What's shooting us? Oh, it's an armored car. It's a BA-6, I think, maybe? Lots of tank were knocked out over here. They're down. There we go. Vehicle knocked out. Medic, how are you doing? Medic, boyos, hit them up. We got most of that, all of these guys that were down. And we're coming in from the rear now as well. Into this town. There's still this, it's still, it's really still up here. I thought it was dead. Ooh, perfect shot through the building. That was very cinematic. Okay, we finally reached. Oh, we did it? Oh, I'm, I'm not done. I don't want to keep playing more. What do you mean we're done? Oh, wait, no. I just got points. That can't mean any good things, can it? Oh, I thought that because we got points, we were about to get, like, counterattack or something. Well, that was honestly a really cool mission. Um, if you liked Gates of Hell, just let me know in the comment section. We're going to be doing a lot more Gates of Hell. But for now, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'd love to see you in the next one. Cheers.